Okay, this is the Baby Jogger City Elite, and we've been getting a few more of these in as the stroller becomes more and more popular. Um, I just wanted to show you really fast how to fix the front wheel mechanism if it becomes rusted so that it won't move, as well as the brakes. So on the front wheel mechanism, when I first got this stroller in, it was in the locked position and it was rusted. What you want to do is flip the stroller on its back and remove the wheel like this. Unscrew this and pull it out. And then if you look underneath here, you'll see that this is how the locking mechanism works. There's a peg that comes out here and this was solid, rusted solid. So I sprayed it with WD-40 and then there's a spring behind it. You can bang it a bit with a hammer, which I've done, such that you're able to twist this around if you hold it in with a screwdriver. Behind it, there's a screw in here. And if you loosen that screw, this provides you with a bit of wiggle room to work with the top mechanism. You can then flip the whole, unscrew it to the extent it will and uh, flip the whole stroller on its back, spray in there with WD-40. And then from the top, you're able to pull up on this a bit then, and you can clean out some grit and sand and use WD-40. And then the way this should work after you've screwed it tight again, is that it sort of pulls upwards as it turns to the side to get the swivel position and goes down when it gets to the locked position. As far as the brakes are concerned, this has, stroller has very intelligent brake design. Um, you have these two bars here that are pressed into the wheels with resistance from springs on either side and the same sort of central pedal design that you have on the Emelunga City Cross. The unfortunate side to that is that if you let this go too far, then the plastic may warp. But if it is rusted so that it won't move, you can turn this on its back or on its side and use Rust Eater to clean up here along these areas and WD-40. And if it won't move, what has happened is that rust on either side of these little plastic tunnels has thickened the bar and is present, preventing it from going through. So you can kind of work the bar such that you can pull it out and sand. Uh, I use a Dremel, an electronic sanding tool. Sand around the sides, then you can pull it the other direction and work on it along the top so that you get it, get the bar back to the correct size to fit through the tunnel and then you can uh, oil it up properly. Yeah, thanks very much.